Holy Week takes a somber turn on Thursday. It is the day of the Last Supper. During this supper, Jesus washed the feet of his disciples and laid out the model for the Eucharist. Also, Jesus predicted the events that would immediately follow, including his betrayal, the denial of Peter, his death, and resurrection. At the end of the day, Jesus enters into the Garden of Olives, as the Apostle John describes it. We are in front of the Basilica of Agony. Also known as the Church of All Nations, or Basilica of Gethsemane, it is the sanctuary sheltering a stone that remains intact, reminiscent of Jesus' agony. When you're inside the Church of All Nations, the dim light produced by using translucent purplish-blue alabaster windows give you the dispirited atmosphere on the night of agony. In front of the main altar, at the center, the pilgrims kneel and embrace the stone of the agony. Here, Jesus prayed directly to his Father on this rock during the night of his agony, the night before his crucifixion. The rock is encircled by a crown of forged iron in the form of a crown of thorns to recall the crown which the Roman soldiers placed on the head of Jesus. Jesus. 